When you're a professional communicator, of which being good at, I am one of them, people want to know what you think. In fact, one of America's smartest doctors is so interested in my great ideas that she interviews me every week in her office for nearly an hour. During our last interview session, she calls them sessions because they're obviously like music to her ears. <laughs> I call them obsessions because she writes down everything that I say. <laughs> she asked me, Rubber Matt from rubbermat.com. <laughs> if your house were on fire and you could only remove one thing, what would it be? And as always, there are no right or wrong answers. And I said, well, I'd probably remove the fire. <laughs> Which I believe is the right answer. <laughs> and I know not all of us have connected yet, I realize that. I, I operate on a different frequency, okay? I'll, I'll be doing my lectures and my great ideas are so high over people's heads, I'll actually see them roll their eyes upward to try to see my thoughts as they escape beyond their grasp of understanding. <laughs> Now on to tonight's topic, immigration, okay? Now, aside from uh, the telephone alternating current, blue jeans, the atomic submarine, um, multi-engine aircraft, uh, video gaming devices, and the polio vaccine, what have immigrants done for us? Not much, okay? Unless you want to include mm, uh, the national park system, labor unions, and uh, the microphone, the transistor, uh, safety belts, insulin, uh, self-contained underwater breathing apparatus, or scuba, uh, oral contraceptives, and the miracle that is Velcro. But, you know, maybe I'm old fascist, but I think we would have come up with those eventually, right? It's like they're stealing our ideas before we even invent them. But who are they, okay? It's, it's fun and real easy to stereotype a whole group of people, but I wanna know who these immigrants are, so I figured I'd do some research. I got online. The best way to learn about some people is to study their culture, right? Things like music, junk like that. So I found an immigrant song called uh, Immigrant Song, and I thought we would read it to get a better idea of who we're talking about. So these are the lyrics or words from a song. Ah, uh, 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 that's how it starts. Uh, uh, uh. Well, there's, there's a lot more. <laughs> I come from the land of the ice and snow, from the midnight sun where the hot springs blow. Okay. Yeah, so like Scandinavia, I'm guessing, somewhere over there. <laughs> Hammer of the gods will drive our ships to new land to fight the hordes, sing and cry, Valhalla, I am coming. <laughs> but but how, are they, how are they getting here? You know, what kind of time frame are we looking at? Well, there's more right here. <laughs> On we sweep with threshing ore, our only goal will be the western shore. Rowboats, okay, so we have some time to come up with a plan. And, and yet the song continues. Ah, again. Ah, we come from the land of the ice and snow, from the midnight sun, where the hot springs blow. All right, they're very persistent. I got it. Okay. <laughs> how soft your field, so green. That's nice. Can whisper tales of gore, of how we calm the tides of war. We are your overlords. Okay, that, that's a red flag right there. <laughs> when, when you have people coming in here. Gore and, and war and overlords? No, that's that's not going to fly. But like I said, we have some time uh, to maybe set up something on, on the eastern seaboard there to stop them from coming. Some armored, you know, ship, you know, some leaden zeppelins, I think, up in the sky <laughs> to keep them away. Gulf, they're not going to come in Gulf of Mexico. We already uh, deployed Operation Slick Job there to keep all the people from coming there. So. I think that side's pretty well protected. 
And I know, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, what about the other immigrants, you know, from, from down south? Well, I found another song, okay? <laughs> Do you come from a land down under? <laughs> Where women glow and men plunder? Can you hear? Can you hear the thunder? Yeah, good questions, all of them. And here's another question back to you from, from your same song. Do you speak of my language? And then he smiled and gave me a Vegemite sandwich. I'm not worried about those guys taking jobs from anybody because those men are at work already. 